okay sir am i audible yes yes okay good afternoon everyone i am see harshit malviya from bhilai chatisgarh first of all thank you to the president sir vice president sir and all ai committee members for giving me this opportunity to present my use case uh, so my today's topic is rcm auto invoice generator uh, i am sharing my screen right now My today's topic is RCM Auto Invoice Generator Streamlining GST Compliance with Python and ChatGPT. So, uh, the problem statement is we see most of the cases we handle for our GST clients, there is one common problem that we need to generate self invoice for RCM. And as we all know that the, for taking input tax credit, we have to uh, in place a tax invoice on the basis of which we can claim ITC but that is not present in case of RCM ITC if we avail ITC from unregistered dealers. So this is the problem. And if you going to uh, prepare RCM invoices manually, it will take uh, the uh, lengthy time and also error prone. So generation of self, to overcome the situation, I developed a use case for generating self invoices in PDF from Excel summary. Uh, we can export RCM summary for self-invoicing from Tally or any other accounting software in Excel file. And that Excel file with some predefined column headings and some alterations can be used for generating PDF invoices with the help of ChatGPT and Python code. So these are the predefined columns which we need for the Python coding, like date, invoice type, document number, supplier name, supplier GST number, recipient name. All these columns can be easily uh, exported from your accounting software. We all are chartered accountants, not programming experts. So we don't know how to uh, write Python code and which Python libraries we have to use for this task. So we can ask ChatGPT to instruct us to be doing the same. So these are the Python packages which we need here. Pandas, OpenPY Excel, and FPDF for Report Lab. It's a simple, it works on simple code logic that we load Excel file that use Pandas to open and read the invoice sheet. Iterate rows, process each row representing one invoice, create PDF, generate invoices with FPDF or report lab using structured data, and save the file in designated folder. So I'll show you my Excel file that I exported from Tally. This is the Excel file where I predefined these column headings. You can export it from Tally and arrange in a, a systematic manner. Like the first column is date, second one is voice type, document number, supplier name, supplier GST number, recipient name, recipient GST number, recipient address, particulars, place of supply, HSN, taxable amount, rate, CGST, SGST, IGST, and total invoice value. Okay, you can have uh, any number of rows here or just uh, presenting my use case, I have taken run nine rows. So what the code will do, it will create one PDF invoice for one row. Like here are nine rows. So I will get nine PDF invoices. I'll close this file. And this is the prompt which I'm going to give to chat GPT. Uh, Remember when it, it is very important, whenever you give instruct uh, chat GPT, you must act, you must uh, tell him that act as expert of the field for which you are asking questions so that it will give you accurate answer. So right now I am doing Python coding. So I'll tell, I will instruct chat GPT to act as Python coding expert so that it will give me accurate results. So this is my prompt. I have an Excel file invoices summary. The file name is invoices summary, wherein sheet tab sheet one, each row represents one invoice summary. I want to generate a separate PDF file for each row, one PDF per invoice. So I defined columns in Excel sheet in row one, like I showed you, uh, starting from A1 to Q1, like date, invoice, and all those things. So location of the folder where Excel is saved is eight. Uh, this is the location of my folder. Each PDF should nicely format the invoice data. Header of generated invoice will be text invoice, self invoice under RCM. 
Add signature placeholder at the bottom of the table for authorized signatory. Take company name from column, recipient name in Excel. Prefix rupees for figures and also convert total invoice value in words. Give PDF invoice in professional design, table layout, style. So I'll just copy this code and paste it to chat GPT. Remember one thing, whenever you do Python coding with chat GPT, it is not necessary that you will get the expected results in one shot. You have to keep trying and to get the desired results. So let us just try here whether this code will work or not in one go. Otherwise, I have another file to show you. I'm copying this code from here and pasting in text file. And you have to save this text file as a python file dot py. And just click on, uh, I'll show, I will delete this PDF folder from here. So there's no invoices here right now. I'll just click on this generate invoices. Let's see whether the code will work. Okay. So all the rows in Excel are now converted to each PDF file. This is the data that is, that is present there in Excel file. So one row is now converted to one PDF invoice. You can see. So there are nine line items in my Excel file. So nine invoices are present in this folder now. So this is all about my presentation, sir. A uh, very useful tool, Harshit Ji. Thank you, sir. Yeah. So it's a very amazing use case. I think it can not only be used for creating invoices. Anything yes. where we have a single row of data and you want to generate a PDF out of that, I think your code and your approach will be useful for all those situations. Right. Thank you. Sir. Thank you very much, Harshit Ji. Yeah. So, uh, can I all can I request all of you to please switch on your video? So, dear participants, uh, you have made amazing presentations. Each of the presentations was very useful for all uh, practicing chartered accountants, for all industry people, because the <clears throat> the amazing way in which you are using AI to create different value additions for CA firms, it was very good and surprising and, you know, it was uh, very proud to see 